Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Play Kerbal Space Program. Now, if you don't know what this game is, basically it's a game where you control these little guys right here, the Kerbals, and you basically, it's exactly what it sounds like, you run your own space program. Now what's cool about this is it's sort of, it's going to be a business sim, that part isn't so much in it yet, but it's currently a flight sim as well as sort of a building game. You sort of, see, I've built this. I put this together kind of like Lego. It's There's all kinds of parts. Let me just show you. Uh, so a lot of these are mod parts, but, you know, there's a ton of parts in the game you can use to basically build whatever you want to do, and people have done some crazy, crazy stuff in this game. Uh, so this is basically sort of like an Apollo lookalike, and by Apollo lookalike, I mean it's, well, I saw the movie Apollo 13 and thought, sure, I can do that, but in the meantime, see, we can have our own flags and everything. NASA, this is actually not a mod, this flag. NASA actually officially supports this game now. In fact, these parts are with the latest pack, uh, which included a bunch of NASA parts. But whatever, you don't want to hear me talk about this. You want to see me fly this thing. Uh, you won't see me fly this thing. You know what? Yeah, I will. I think I might do an... I may do an external view of this launching at the end. But in the meantime, I'm going to try and launch this entirely from the IVA view. So let's move to the launch pad now. Okay, so here we are on the launch pad, and you may notice there's the Kerman brothers down there, Bill, Jebediah, and Bob, the most famous three, and uh, you may notice they're not quite looking themselves, are they? Uh, that's a mod I'll be including in the description, or maybe just at the end of the video, I'll have an entire list of all the mods that you see present in this video. Uh, for example, the Sky, uh, that's a combination of the... Better Atmospheres mod and the uh, Visual Enhancements mod. You can see on the flagpole over there, I've selected a Soviet flag as my default, but anytime I do a NASA recreation, I like to have their flag. And there's the VAB over there, the whole Science Center. Uh, so, whatever, we've seen enough of this. Let's go inside and see what we can do. So here's Bill Kerman. Actually, no, I'm going to switch to Bob, because it's better for when we need to eventually dock with our lander. So... I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to the moon or not, because I've never done anything but get to orbit in this view. And if you look around here, you'll see... I can't see anything out these windows. That's because we're in side of the fairings right now. Basically, those will jettison, but right now they're on, so that we'll be more aerodynamic on our way up. My computer is screaming right now. But whatever, everybody just wants me to get on with it. So I'm going to first... I, I only know how to use these systems, which are also a mod from playing Orbiter, which I am awful at. I've only just barely managed to get Atlantis into orbit. So I'm going to go here. Is this what I need to do? No, it's not. I think in front of me, I'm going to want... How do I do... Okay, there we go. There's the nav ball. See, I know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, how do we see this? No. Nope. Oh, yeah, no, here we are. That's... Yeah, we need to see our... That's our apoapse. That's how high we're going to go, and that's our periapse. We need that to be... We need both of these basically to be over 70 kilometers. And we're going to try and go to the moon. I don't know how well we're going to be able to do that because I've made it so that we're... Well, hang on. Let me just show you on the map view real quick. You can see the moon is right over there. I believe that we won't even need to circularize our orbit. I believe that by the time we're in orbit, uh, we'll be able to just keep burning straight and make our way over there in one long burn. So let's... Uh, hmm, what else? I feel like I'm missing something. Uh, info? No. This? No. This? I'm missing something. I know it. Hmm. Well, I guess the thing I'm thinking of is only on some cockpits. Oh, well, no. There it is right there on the front, but eh, it's kind of far away for me to see. Oh, well, I'm going to turn on my SAS, and there it is lighting up. That'll keep me stable during the ascent. Although not too stable. You'll see what I mean in a second. Uh, okay. Start throttling up only partially at first and like the main engine whoa like the SRB and jettison and we are airborne let's throttle up all the way how, how are we looking okay as long as it looks like this we're straight up and this shaking is also a mod it's a really cool mod I downloaded I'll put that up uh, you know, I'm probably, I'm going to be pointing out mods as I go, so maybe I don't even need to have a list, but I think I still will. I'll think, I think I'll share links in the description. Uh, I'm not even looking at what I'm doing. We're already moving 216 meters per second. That's our vertical velocity. It's all vertical velocity right now. Wow, this is actually much harder. I've never done this with this mod installed. I'm going to throttle back some because we're pushing against the atmosphere pretty dang hard right now, and our 
SRBs are still going, so we're going to continue to gain speed. We're only at 4.1 kilometers of altitude. That's not good. Uh, hmm, we're pushing pretty hard. That must be pretty tough on the craft. But we're gaining altitude. Once we get to about 10 kilometers, I think we're pretty much in the safe zone. We can go as fast as we want. But right now, the atmosphere is really, really dense where we are. This is kind of jerky, this mod right here. I wish it was a little smoother. Uh, d doesn't um, Flight Simulator 10 have a mod that's kind of like this? Uh, but we're running out of fuel on our solid boosters right now. And jettison. There they go. Uh, now we're losing speed. Throttle up again. Uh, we're going at pretty decent speed, and we can start to do our gravity turn a little bit. It's hard to... Uh-oh. I think I may have turned over a little too far and too hard. Come on, let's maintain that heading. Or attitude. Uh, let's maintain. Ooh, man. It's, it's fighting me right now. It's fighting me, but we're 17 kilometers up. It's fighting me hard. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're flipping over. We're flipping over. That's not good. Okay, I'm going to cut the engines. Maybe we can bring it back. Maybe it'll flip over all the way. This isn't good. We're losing a lot of speed right now. Uh, okay, I'm hoping we can get it up there, get it close to our prograde marker, turn on the engines, and we're losing it again. We're losing it again. Okay, we need to wait for another pass. That at least got us some of our speed back. Oh, God, you can see... I don't know if you can see in 720p, but... There's the ground rotating in front of us, or it's detecting objects on the ground. Uh, I hope we have enough speed to do this right. Uh, okay, we're going to burn our engines starting now. Come on, bring it up. Get that engine gimbling should save us. Mm. Okay, we're coming into our third full rotation now. Oh man, this isn't good. How, how fast are we moving? 442 meters per second. So we're doing we're doing better than we were. We have decent altitude, but ooh, it looks like that's mostly lateral velocity. We need to get that vertical velocity back up. I think we're yeah, we're starting to drop. Come on. We're above our pro grade. We just need to bring it back. Hmm. I may have to do the abort. Can I do the abort from in here? Uh, it's so hard to see when it's shaking like this. Okay, I, I'm convinced we can still do it. We don't have much left in the stage, so maybe we'll regain some control, actually, once we're in the next... Oh, no, we're now flipping back in the other direction. Okay, we can't do this. Uh, we need to... Is there an abort button here that I can press? Um, okay, oh, my fairings have been sheared off. Oh, no, we actually we wobbled so hard we wobbled through the fairings. Okay, we need to get rid of all of that. Let's throttle to zero. Boom, there go the fairings. Oh, that's Whoa, that one's just flying off into nothing. Look how high up we are. We're at uh, 15 kilometers and falling. We need to... Okay, let's get rid of our... Oh. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten rid of the escape tower like that. Okay. Uh... Jettison the pod. Jettison the heat shield, too, because I don't think we need it right now. Come on. Why isn't it responding? Okay. Uh, disable the SAS because we're falling. Where are we now? Nine kilometers. Okay, let's deploy those chutes. Oh, man, we have a lot of slowing down to do. Uh, let's see if we can click on these and see if we can see out the window better. No. Okay. And look at those clouds. I, I love this better atmosphere mod. I think I'm going to need to split this into a part two because this isn't going well at all. My problem was I turned over way too aggressively, and it's exacerbated by the fact that on this thing right here, um, it updates only every couple of seconds, or maybe it just looked that way because of the shaking. Hmm. I definitely need to rethink the way I do this. How far are we from the... Okay, the, those over there, you can't... You most definitely cannot see it in the video, but I'm seeing... That's 46 kilometers. Okay, we're 46 kilometers from where we launched. Oh, we're not slowing down fast enough at all. Not at all. Um, well, guys, looks like this might be it. Are we slowing down at all? Why aren't we... Hmm. Oh, that must be orbital velocity. 
Wait, can we switch that from here? Uh, I don't know how we can change that. Okay, no, we're only moving 7 meters per second. Okay, so what's our altitude? Our altitude above the ground is 300 meters. I think we're about to splash down safely. Hmm. What do you think of this? Jebediah is in the back. Uh, let's switch to... Yeah, no. Switch to him. Okay, looks like we're all right here. No, I want to see the interior. 170 meters from the ground. I'm going to accelerate a little bit. We should be very, very close to a splashdown. I don't think I'm going to split the video. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try and get into orbit in these... Okay, and there's the... T hmm. Things look a little darker now that we're underwater. Well, I suppose that makes sense. Okay, let's see how we're doing. Yep, there we are, splashed down. We unfortunately never made it to the moon. We never even made it to orbit, in fact. But we did get quite a bit of distance. Well, I guess you can't see it from here, but we did get quite a bit of distance. And that counts for something, doesn't it? No, it doesn't.